Hey everyone, welcome back to your eighth native script video tutorial in which we're going to take a look at how to create button in a native script application. And uh, it's pretty simple, actually way simpler than creating an action bar. What you have to do is just go ahead and write button and a closing button. <laughs> That's it. So in order to again make it visible, because if you save it now, you're going to see it's not visible. So you need to give it a text, which is what the button should say right so you could just give it my first button right and then this button you can see on the screen is just like an ios button now you're gonna see on android you're gonna see a different kind of button obviously depending on how android renders it natively now again you have to remember that these buttons all this stuff is actually native button on the platform it's not some java it's not some html and css effect right now obviously these um, button come with some sort of events attached to it you can give it a tap event that what happens when you tap it and you're going to write a name of a function let's say this is um, button pressed so once you do that we know that in our code along file we discuss that if i export this button pressed method and if i did like um, button pressed something like this and it's save what you're gonna see is if I click this button let it just reload first right so if I click this button you're gonna see we get an alert button pressed right pretty simple just three lines of code here just seven lines of code here and you've got an interactive application right away so that that blows up my mind with native script right that's this is pretty cool and uh, this is all native as well you see you're using JavaScript but this actually uses native alert UI now remember that we do not have discussed these events and stuff yet so if you don't understand this just forget this part for now we, we can just create a button by just doing button giving it a text and a closing button tag that's it that renders your first button that's all for this video if you liked it don't forget to subscribe press the bell icon and obviously like the video and i'll see you then in the next one